Time for Big Game Breakdown. As always, live odds, sportsbookreview.com. Warriors in D.C. to take on the Wiz. Golden State, 6.5, 229.5 the total. Big game for the Wiz, but are they up to the challenge? They went into the break, 15-2 and two straight up, led in the final half second of both losses. Out of the break, 0-2 straight up in ATS, lost to the spread by 29 rebounds, 100-60 to 60 in favor of Philly and Utah. Yeah, and of course, after the loss to the Jazz, John Wall kind of went off <laughs> on the officiating. Quote, it's frustrating. You keep attacking the basket. No name guys. Getting calls on the other end. That's getting little contact. You drive to the basket and get contact the whole game. They try to make up for those calls the last two or three minutes of the game. It gets frustrating. But I got to do a better job as a leader of this team in keeping my emotions in check. But don't try to give me the calls late to make me feel good. That's not going to change the outcome or how aggressive I want to be in the game. And Wall may have something there. I mean, the free throws in the first half against Utah. Wizards 1, Jazz 18. Of course, he can't necessarily blame uh, his turnover problems on the fouls. I mean, you could blame him on but the bottom line, he had nine turnovers uh, against Utah after six versus Philly. The thing that worries me, and you talked about that dominance on the boards. They were killed 52-27 to uh, against Utah after getting clocked against Philadelphia. And if there's one area where Washington may well have a weakness, you know, <laughs> uh, the rebounding really stands out. Look at this graphic, uh, Polly. Real clear. The Wizards, as a team, 240 minutes, they had 27. Rudy Gobert, 36 minutes, he had 20. That's not a good ratio. Nope, you're right about that. Homecoming uh, for Durant, born in D.C., played high school ball at Oak Hill Academy. Uh, Golden State, just 1-5 and five ATS, second night of back-to-backs on the road. Kerr, quote, here you go, Golden State. Here's your marquee game against the Spurs on a Saturday night on ABC, and it'll be your eighth game in 12 days with 10,000 miles. It's insane. So got to be very, very caref- careful about our players' welfare and make sure they're fresh and not too fatigued because we know that can lead to injury, end quote. I never got to, I didn't have to worry about it against Philly because they were in control, even though Curry couldn't make a shot. But we'll see what he does with the minutes down the stretch. Green played 36 minutes. Thompson played 36 minutes. Curry 34 and Durant 32. So we'll see how he handles it moving forward, Teddy. Well, that's just it. I I mean, in theory, against Philadelphia, when you're 14-point road favorites, you're supposed to be able to coast in that game and keep your starters on the bench for extended stretches. And that didn't happen last night. Uh, The Sixers, you know, it, it wasn't a tight contest, but it wasn't a blowout either. And it's a set that's, that's the same Kerr quote we had on the show uh, last week coming out of the All Star break, but it's worth repeating twice. Golden State, you know, they've been bad ATS in the second night of back to backs on the road. You have a coach who's really worried about managing minutes, and he's calling his, this particular road trip insane with the back to back situations. And everybody played more minutes than they were supposed to last night. So I know the Wizards haven't looked good those first two games out of the break. This might be a spot for Washington to bounce back. Go to SBRodds.com. Browse, compare, and shop live odds available at top online sportsbooks. Hey, guys, for the full video, go to SBRpicks.com.